Hi there, my name is Steve Blicko. I'm playing Train Station 2. Quick uh, little tip here on why you need to have multiple locomotives of each type. So if you look here in your locomotive list, uh, say uh, this is uh, Region 8 for me, you can see I have a bunch of legendaries, these yellow ones. There's So there's the combination of legendary, uh, the rarity and the type. So I have legendary steam, I only have one of those. Legendary diesel, I have one, he one year legendary diesel. And down here I have a second legendary diesel. So I only have two legendary diesels, but I have four legendary electrics. One, two, three, four. So the reason why you want to have multiple of each type is for jobs like this. See here, this job here, this event job, uh, is level eight. It's a legendary diesel. It needs both of those. So if you look at this job, I only have two possible locomotives that can go there. And I just sent them a few minutes ago. And they're on their way, but I can't send any more because there are no trains available. I have no more legendary diesels that I can send. So this is a one-hour job to, to go out there, deliver the goods, and come back. So this really slows me down in the event. So the same situation happens here for this one. This is a rare electric. And again, I only have two rare electrics. And uh, so I have to wait for them to come back, and I send them out again. Even though I have 11 dispatchers in total, I can only I can only send a couple of locomotives to each of those events because of the type restrictions that are on them. So always always try to keep three at least of each combination if you can, so that you don't get stuck in situations like this. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.